Calorie question, I think it's relevant in certain con uh, companies. In certain companies, it really doesn't matter what you say. Uh, the larger companies have very, very defined uh, protocols on how they will uh, decide your pay structure. So based on your education, based on your experience, uh, your job profile. So if you go to a large company and tell them you want any figure, it's not going to matter. So I think certain large companies, when you're interviewed, you should say, I, I'm sure your policies have something in place. I'm okay with that. I think that's the simplest answer, which, uh, which makes sense. And there's no point of going you know, all over the place. If it's a smaller setup where there is a leeway, that means you have your, your conversation is going to impact the salary. Then you can you know, pitch what you're looking for. But again, homework. So if you're, if you're on Glassdoor, if you're on Naukri.com, there's, there's a lot of research to show for your role, for your um, experience, for the, uh, the niche in which you are, which industry vertical you're working for, you know, what are the salary bands like? And they'll even tell you things like, if it's a small and medium company, this is the salary range you can expect. If it's a larger company, this is what you can expect. So the first thing is to be realistic that you don't have to just go and, you know, I need, I want to buy a house next year. So I want, you know, five lakhs a month. I mean, that's not, that's not the way to handle an interview. So you need to come across as somebody who's done homework, who is realistic and who is able to talk from an understanding of the industry. So you, you, you'll actually start by saying, for this role in this industry, I understand the salary could be between this and this. And then you can pitch at the higher end saying, I would like to, uh, I'd be happy if I can get something at the higher end because I bring a lot of value to the table. So you are valuing yourself. You're asking for what you want, but you're doing it on a platform of uh, understanding where the market stands. So if you mention that, that little bit of research you've done, I think the respect that they have for you goes up. Then they're not going to look at it as arbitrary demands. So I would say just that's the way it is. Large companies don't sweat over it. Um, companies where your conversation is going to have an impact and you're really getting, going to get into a negotiation, then you that's the place where you pitch your skills and strengths uh, very solidly and you ask for something which is based on industry bands. If you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe for more of these informative videos.